Hey guys, and welcome to my how-to tutorial on how to set up your uh, Pageant DZ09 smartwatch. So these are really cool smartwatches, um, nice and expensive too. So you can, I'll put a link below where you can buy them. Um, if you use my link, you know I get a percentage of that um, commission. So help me out. So here we go, guys. I'm show you how to set it up with your smartphone so this definitely definitely works on both android and um iphones as well but with iphones with the newer version that came out they're not compatible for like checking text messages and all that stuff you can still make and receive calls but you won't be able to make text messages or read them with android any version of android will work i've tried it on my uh samsung galaxy 6 edge so I'm trying it with my Carousera as well so you can see that it does work with older and newer phones. So first what you want to do is you want to go to the Play Store and look up BT Notifier. It's going to look like this one. It's this one right here. And then if you scroll down, it'll be another one just like it. You want to go ahead and download both of them. You can get away with downloading just one, but the way I like doing it, that I've seen it work all the time, is just if you download both of them. I'll show you how. So just go into your Play Store, download BT Notifier. So there's that one. Alright, now what you want to do is go ahead and open the first one. So say uh, Enable Accessibility, you click OK. It's going to take you to Accessibility, guys. You want to make sure these both are on. So you want to turn on BT notification and then since you download the other one you turn that one on as well. So turn both of them on. It's super important that you do this. If not, it's not going to get your um, text messages and all that stuff. So now with that you should be okay but just to be you know double check you open another one and it'll be okay. Now that you have the app you want to go ahead and Turn on your smart uh, smartwatch. So there we go, guys. As you can see, right now it says 106, but it's really 1250. So don't worry, we're gonna set this up. You want to go into your settings, Bluetooth on your phone. Turn that on, and then on your smartwatch, you also want to go onto Bluetooth. Now make sure if, uh, you click settings and if it shows visibility um, timeout, you click it and show no limit. So uh, newer phones like this, it doesn't matter. So now let's go to Bluetooth. Once you go to Bluetooth on your smartwatch, you want to click visibility, make sure it's on. So switch it on and then see how it says off right there. Make sure you click it again to be on. So with Bluetooth being on on your phone and on your watch, you click search new device, click search new device. It's going to be searching and there we go, it found my device. You want to click pair, it's going to search, it's going to pair with this, you click yes and you click pair. Now it's connected. Now it says sync data and time with remote um, and you want to click yes, it'll sync. You can view this if you want or just close it. And there we go, 1251 guys, 1252, well, you know, close enough, right? Uh, let me see if I can get this a little closer so you can see it better. There you go. So that's it, guys. That's all you literally have to do. Now, um, you have to be, of course, within Bluetooth range. So now watch this. Um, well, this one doesn't have any service right now. Um, it can still, I believe, receive calls. No, I can't even make calls out of it. Um, but now you can check your text messages and stuff. Like, see if I try to make a call. I don't have service on this one, but you will see. Let me just show you what it does. Uh, 910. Let's see what number should I uh, call. I don't know, just a random one, I guess. You click call, BT call, click OK, and it'll start doing it. And see, it right away start doing it from my phone. And you can hear it too. And 
and you can also hang up from your watch which is really really cool now for text messages you click text messages inbox and it'll load your text messages look at that well let me see if I can you can open it and you can see your text messages so on time payment so I made my uh, on time payment so you made one on time payment towards earning additional data guys I said you can check congratulations da -da -da. you know and then you click options and then you can reply you know to who do you want to send to to your contacts it also has access to your contacts which is really really cool um, like I said I don't use this phone for anything um, but it's really cool guys so that's how you set up uh, your smartwatch so it's the PenGen uh, DZ um, 09 this works with all other smartwatches too guys so it's really really cool um, hope you like this please comment rate and subscribe and yep